All right, guys, <coughs> at me uh, parents' new house again. Uh, I just thought I'd let you see, you know, how things are coming on because we've had a few days off it sort of thing. Not been able to get much done. Um, but I've been uh, <coughs> cracking on with the kitchen again. Uh, I'll turn it around actually and just turn the camera around, let's see. I've, uh, I've still got the end to cut off this piece of work up here. As you can see, we're just in junk and tools everywhere at the minute. I've just taken some of my tools back out to the car actually, my uh, so I've got the work tops in. Um, as you can see, I've done a, a routed join along there. And had another one to do over there. And I've just uh, PVA the sink opening actually. Uh, letting that go off a bit and then I'll get the uh, the sink in. Um, and then get the taps. I'll put some taps in. I don't know where they are. But there they are. New set of taps. So, uh, so yeah, it's coming along all right actually. I'm... Uh, Expecting carpet fitters any time actually. <coughs> uh, got let down by the supplier actually, who um, <coughs> who uh, didn't get the carpets here for the fitters in time. So uh, the fitters anyway, they, they got on with the um, the underlay and beading as you can see, you know, the uh, gripper and that and the traps. So we've just got three three rooms at the minute that are getting carpets put in, um, and then. Uh, the whole way we're leaving until last. Uh, we're going to wait until they're in because we're going to be a bit more messy in here maybe yet because uh, we're looking at maybe having some handrails for me dad along the wall. Um, this is going to be his room to start with. This little one here. Uh, it's a nice little room actually. Really nice. Um, <coughs> so my uh, brother and his wife have done a great job of decorating because uh, this, this uh, living room is a good sized living room actually. It's all finished now. All papered all the way round. Uh, I've still got that socket to put on. It's all safe at the minute, but the, the cables are in the socket at the other side. Uh, this wall actually, there's one on the back of here. So, uh, yeah, there's a socket to go in here because I think she, I think I'll get plugged in down here to be honest. There's a lamp and a hoover occasionally when uh, she hoovers up. So, uh, yeah, this was a second hand sofa that she picked up because uh, the one she's got are too big. Obviously, because it's a much bigger house, so uh, so yeah, it's uh, it's coming along nicely anyway. But uh, I've got all the doors to change on the kitchen yet, doors and drawer fronts, which are all there, yeah, because it's just a refresh. Because these are bloody horrible, they really are. The worktops that came out were rank, and it also had that crappy bloody splashback on, if you remember. But we're going to get all that tiled, and then I'll just cut <coughs> that end off, leave enough room there for the cooker. Uh, washing machine going under there and she's decided she wants her tumble dryer in the shed which is on the back of the building so and this is going to be uh, where our fridge freezer goes um, it was a cupboard obviously uh, we've taken the door off that's gone we we'll fill all this in tidy all this up uh, and we're putting some wood beading in there we'll fill all this up and it'll just sort of tidy it up, you know, so when there's a fridge freezer standing there, it just looks like a little inlet that was designed for it, you know, and I'll put a piece of, uh, tim a piece of board running down to the top of the fridge freezer, a piece of four inch timber across to tidy it all up. So yeah, it should all look uh, really nice for them. But uh, yeah, as soon as we get these carpets down, it means we can start moving some furniture in, you see, and then once this kitchen's done, it means they can actually sort of move in. Um, you know, because the, there'll be full access and everything. I mean, obviously at the minute he's still using a wheelchair and what have you, but we've also got him one of those uh, rising reclined chairs. We managed to pick one of those up cheap. Uh, that's actually at uh, at the workshop in a minute. I'm still waiting for these bloody carpet fitters that were supposed to be here. Well, I said there'd be somebody there from 12 onwards because I had to go into Hull this morning to do some delivery work. Uh, so it's, you know what carpet fitters are like, they're a law unto themselves, so God knows what time I'll get home. Although once they're here, to be honest, they'll have that down in half an hour. So, you know, it's just a matter of waiting. So anyway, I'll catch up later anyway, guys, okay? Hey guys, I didn't get anything put on uh, the rest of yesterday's, but I'm uh, back here today and, uh, I couldn't get any ivory sealant for me uh, sink 
So I'm a bit peed off with that. That's uh, sat waiting for that because my mum's going with an ivory cream theme like so. I didn't want to go with a stark white sealant around the sink, <coughs> which obviously would get grubby anyway. So, but uh, yeah, so I came in and I just sort of like tidied up a few bits and pieces, and I'm just uh, I'm just changing the doors at the minute. Uh, now, obviously, I'm having to re-drill because it's an older style kitchen. I'm having to re-drill for the hinges a little bit. So I've uh, made up a just a little stick really. That there, that denotes that's the front edge of the cabinet, and that always goes on the bottom where it says bottom there. And all I'm having to do, all it is, is it's 32 mil different. So all I'm having to do is actually redrill one hinge, uh, one screw, and then it's just a case of moving uh, a screw over. You see, so you know it's it's not much difference. It just means that there'll be like a screw on sh uh, a hole on show that it had a screw in it. But obviously it's inside the cabinet. But uh, I've just come to put in the now. I'm actually short on doors. I think we need another. Yeah, you know, we need two more five hundreds. But let me just show you something. Right, right. So that's that's uh, the old doors. This is the new ones that are going. I've still got the drawer fronts to do, as you can see. Uh, but we're going with these ivory ones, and I've still got to align them, obviously as well. But um, what it is, I've. I've got those two to change and we uh, B and Q didn't have all the doors in so I've got them to collect. I've done that one over there. Uh, I've done those you can see there. Now I've come to do the only 600 in here. I've put that cabinet in and uh, put a door on that but we need a draw pack for that. But here I am putting the hinges on this 600 door and I thought I looked at the cabinet and I thought oh it was hung on the left it would be better if that's hung on the right. So I thought, well, that's great. And I came across, and then I noticed something. I thought, hang on, screw, screw, no screws. And then I thought, you've got to be kidding me. So that side's got nothing in it. <laughs> you know, that's council fitters for you, innit? You know, uh, wait, well, it's not council fitters. You know, the, the council's hire firms to do this, and that's the shoddy workmanship you get. I mean, that is ridiculous. You know, they, just the door alone is sort of like, you know, that door's got to be sort of three, four kilos, you know. And I almost just went and hung that straight on the other side without even thinking about it. You know, expecting that that would be fully screwed to the wall. And that is just ridiculous. You know, that, that could have been something serious, you know. If that had been, you know, if somebody, other fitter had uh, come along and said, oh, I'll swap that door around for you while I'm here, you know. For, for the you know doing it for the council sort of thing you know because the the customer had said you know can, can we have it swapped around but I sent somebody along and he wouldn't even thought about that he just swapped it over and it could have been some little old lady getting an entire bloody cabinet drop on her so it's absolutely disgraceful that so you know <clears throat> that's the sort of stuff you got to put up with carpet fitter still didn't turn up yesterday <clears throat> great they're supposed to be turning up between two and three today so I've got about another hour or so uh, <clears throat> before they turn up, hopefully. Fingers crossed. So I will get back to you later on. Uh, I've still got the knobs to put on these as well, like uh, which are just like a plain oak knob. Uh, we wanted beach, um, but they didn't have a beach. Uh, so we got a light oak one, which you know pretty much matches. Just a single knob, uh, you know, in the corner of the door and centre of the drawer front. But anyway, I'll, uh, I mean, I'll throw some more in, you know, when it finally gets done. So we've got more to show you, you know, when we get it tiled and all that sort of stuff. But I'll get back to you any, uh, later on today anyway, guys. Yeah, <sighs> finally. Finally home. Finally sorted for the night. Half seven. So, uh, it's done. Just got a few more bits to do on the kitchen. Still got to get that sink plumbed in. Uh, carpets are down finally. That got done about uh, half four, something like that. So, you know, that was well and truly late. Um, but yeah, it's all looking good anyway. Um, you know, I've just had to nip out again. I did rush my tea down, um, but I'm going to have a cuppa now and.
it's uh, coffee and walnut. So I'm going to have another bit of that with a cuppa. And I'm going to go and put some batteries in my trackpad because they're getting low. And I'm going to call it a night. I'm going to start putting this across over to uh, the Mac and then up to YouTube. It's just easier that way. It's easy. I just I just link this straight up. It transfers it straight across. It's it's so easy, um, and it just goes up quicker than it does direct from the phone. So uh, it's just going to be better that way. And it also means that all my automatic tags that are already up there and whatever you, it, uh, it it doesn't upload all them. You see when you do it direct from the phone. So that's the way I do it, and it's it's just so much easier. So yeah, I'm pretty much uh, calling it a day there, guys. So uh, tomorrow, I'm going to take my man to be in queue, I think, or somebody is anyway, it might be my brother. Uh, and then I get the day off Thursday, because I've got to go uh, to my Apple appointment. And uh, get that battery sorted. So, uh, yeah, I think that's it pretty much, guys. So uh, take it easy. Uh, and I'll catch you on the next one. Okay. Cheers guys. See ya.